Welcome to this edition of Forest Lake Today, broadcasted to you from Richland 2 in Columbia, South Carolina. We are a whole school and a school within a school magnet. All of our students are a part of our NASA Explorer School Magnet, which utilize the resources and research from NASA, which help to foster an interest in science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. Students attend NASA Lab and Project Lead the Way once a week where they have unique learning experiences that integrate the South Carolina State Standards with NASA related topics and use the design process to work on hands-on activities in computer science, engineering, and biomedical science. Our elementary learning collaborative program uses the William & Mary curriculum for gifted and talented students. For English language arts, and is designed for high ability learners. Now, let's hear from some of our student reporters on what makes our school so special. I'm Jackson, here to tell you why I like going to Project Lead the Way classes. When you go to Pro Project Lead the Way, you will code with groups, get inspiration from videos, and invent things using the engineering design process. Some of the units we have done have been exploring the human body where we had to work with a partner to design and build a cast and infection detection where we experimented with ways to help the spread of disease but my favorite part of project lead the way was building and coding the vex robots i'm cameron and today i'll be telling you what i like about the nasa lab activity and what it's about the activities that we do are all connected to nasa i mean you can learn about all the Apollo missions, all the famous people, and how they build rocket ships. My favorite part of this activity is learning about the planet, finding new things, and learning about astronauts and famous people. We do lots of research in the library. Let me tell you about two of my favorites. In kindergarten, we studied polar animals. When we came to the library, we did lots of hands-on activities to help us learn more about these animals. Putting Crisco in a glove on our hand and then plunging it into ice cold water really helped us understand how blubber keeps polar animals warm. In fourth grade, we, we researched constellations, creating our own using toothpicks and marshmallows, and then made videos to tell others about our constellations. Reese here, and in first grade, we got to go to the moon. Not really, but it was as close as you can get in school. When doing this activity, we created our own mit mission patches and oxygen tanks in class. Then on the first day of the mission, we put on our astronaut suit and walked down the hallways to the moon. When you got there, you did many fun activities, including walking around in moon shoes, excavating rocks, working with tools wearing space gloves, and more that simulates being at the moon. At the end, we had our picture taken with the American flag. Every year, starting in May, everyone starts working on NASA theme activities during our end of the year NASA unit. We've done lots of these so far. Destination Mars, reading, writing, and rings. Destination total solar eclipse and celebrating Apollo, NASA's first steps. And this year, we'll be learning about more about NASA's returning to the moon. When we do Mission Artemis, NASA's next chapter in lunar exploration. The teachers save our work, and then we will we come back to school the next year. The whole school is decorated with our work. That looks great. Steam Fest is a day filled with speakers and activities that help us learn more about science, technology, engineering, the arts, and math. We've mined for rocks with Diamond Dell, learned more about reptiles with Pierce's Scaly Adventures, and we learned and about birds from Carolina Raptor Center. We watched marionettes teach us about recycling and enjoyed steel drum bands and dancers from our district's high schools. It's a great day. I'm Rory and I'm here to tell you why I like NASA Family Nights. At NASA Family Nights, each grade level plans a STEAM activity for families to enjoy together. The Star Lab is set up so we can enjoy learning more about the constellations in there. On NASA nights, there is pizza, too. Also, the chorus has a performance at the end. That is why I like NASA Family Nights. 
Hi, I'm Caden, and we all know run that running is fun. Some of the students join the school's running club where we can keep track of how many laps we run so we can work to do better at the next practice. This makes running way more fun than it already is. Then at our school's annual committee fun run, Run Forest Run, the club members ran together. There were over 600 people at our last Run Forest Run. Having fun and exercising is the best, perfect combination. Thank you for joining us for the special edition of Forest Lake Today. Forest Lake Elementary, NASA Explorer School. Everything we do is about teaching and learning. Remember, we're just around the corner, but worlds apart.